Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to the final episode of season two of Jujutsu Kaisen. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. I don't want to watch this. <laughs> That was not him. <laughs> The details on his eyelashes, oh my god. Yeah, but he's gone now. <laughs> yeah! <laughs>
thing is, how the fuck y'all gonna get out of that? Oh, is she gonna wake up? <laughs> Jumpa. If only he was still alive. Oh my god! Gonna have Mega Man kill his own sister. Oh! <laughs> right? <laughs> But we don't have time, though. Oh my fucking god. The fucking heart. Oh. Uh. 
I mean, abruptly in like that, Jesus, but okay. She would be saying fake news. Oh my god. D just dead. Everyone's dead. You think anywhere else is going to be safe after this? Come on now. And what people gonna believe when they pop up somewhere else? Oh my god! <laughs> right, indeed. <laughs> yeah, they make it a movie! <laughs> been eating for a while.
Don't go out there. Don't be stupid. Mm -mm. It is not that easy. Oh, hell no. Nah. <laughs> you think she's stupid? Mm-mm. Girl, don't go over there. No, 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 no. Girl, your mom probably did. Mm-hmm. Dead. No. There you go. Don't go over there. No kid, oh my god. She about to die. Poor baby, she don't even fucking know it. My God, final. <laughs> so good. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> You're just on your own side. Of course, it's gonna still kill him. Damn.
Oh my god. Just want to know why this one person walking out here by themselves in the middle of the fucking night. I mean, are you dumb? You trying to get killed? Who is Yuji? Well, okay. Final thoughts on this season. Yes, this, overall, this was a depressing season, but good in a way. Only depressing because of the fact is, you know, <laughs> favorite characters <laughs> are gone. And I don't still know how to feel. But this was really good. I felt like for 24 weeks from episode one, not even 24, 23 weeks, but I felt like 24. Um... Everything was beautiful. It's sad. <laughs> like, I, I hate the fact that so many characters had to die. They're even killing off the principal. Be because he... The oh my god. Not that situation. And then now they're, they're saying that Gojo is a conspirator on this shit and then that unsealing him you gonna get killed too I don't even know how to feel and, and then okay my baby you he, he's here uh, finally after how long Oh my god, it felt like forever, like just the teasing every single week and being like, where the heck this dude at? When are you popping up? And he finally pops up. The freaking queen, Megami Nogata, is playing him once again, and I cannot, and she's just so good in the role, but like, oh my god, this isn't the same baby from JJK Zero. He's completely different and such, and so I'm guessing because... It's been a hot minute since I've watched the movie. Now, we know at the end of the movie, Gojo went to go see him and basically was like, hey, I want you to stay here. Possibly because, okay, going going back to season one, we know he left during the part where Yuji, Megamine, and Nobara were doing that one mission by themselves and then leading up to um, Yuji somewhat dying, but he didn't die. And then, you know, he was training with Nanami for a hot minute and such until eventually he came back. So, during that time, Homeboy goes to Africa, <laughs> finds Yuta, and be like, hey, you know, I got a little thing for you. Something's probably coming up. Because it it's like something tells me Gojo had a feeling all this shit was about to go down and everything. So, he was like, hey, if this happens, I need you to kind of step up. And such so I get the reason on not really having him um show up for like the longest time but god dang like something told me if he would have shown up immediately right after Gojo would have been sealed I think all the people who would have died all the characters who were really really freaking important who died in this arc possibly wouldn't have died I'm not really sure like <sighs> You, you gave me nothing on Maki. You gave me something on Inumaki. Inumaki lost his arms. <laughs> my baby lost his arms. Oh, my God. 
she's fine. She's got to be fine. She was just knocked out, so she's okay. I just, I don't know how to feel anymore. But seriously, th this season was good. I mean, season one is good. Season two is better. And from what I've heard about season three and potentially kind of saw... There was this one random TikTok. You know how, like, when you're just scrolling on like, your freaking for you page and then just something just pops up. Um, so I got to see, like, a little bit. Not really, like, a summary, but just, like, certain parts of Season 3, a.k.a. what I like to call Hunger Games on crack. Because it looks like Hunger Games on crack, especially with what Kenjaku was about to do. Um... <laughs> All I have to say is what the fuck. But something tells me we're not going to see this until maybe about fall next year, maybe 2025. Like, I don't think we're getting this, like, that quickly. I think MAPPA... MAPPA has a lot of things on their plate possibly after this. They, ha they still have to do... Not really even Chainsaw Man Season 2. They're doing the movie for, you know, What's Your Face's arc. Then apparently Chainsaw Man Season 3, whenever the hell that's going to be announced. And then anything else that they do have. So yeah, they got a lot of freaking work to do. And I still feel bad for these people because, like, they probably get little to no sleep. And then they got to do the next thing. And, and I hope, like, everybody is just thinking the hell out of them. Because, like, the work that they've done in these last couple of years and what they're going to do in the next few years, it's just, once again, top tier. <sighs> I feel bad for Yuji and like yeah, and then Megamine. You didn't even show me Megamine. Like it's just Yuji by himself. What? Oh God! It's no happy, happy, joy, joy anymore. It's just depression. <laughs> All the depression because Yuji's by himself. Megamine. See, I feel like Megamine's fine. Megamine's fine as well, but Nobara. Never going to get an answer on her. And that's going to fucking suck. I don't know. I, I still don't know how to feel. But seriously, this is good. Oh, but no. Let's talk about the other thing that happened this week. Okay, so from what I have always heard is Tuesday usually is the day when new chapters come out. Well, I clearly forgot. Well... Your girl got spoiled on something else. It, whatever this week's chapter is, got spoiled on another death. I ain't gonna say who it is, but all I'm gonna say is this, and, and this has been on my mind ever since Tuesday freaking night. I felt like we're going, he's going in now where he's just literally like, fuck it, I'm killing everyone. And that's what I'm getting the feels of, especially with what I saw and what was in that spoilers for the leaks this week. I'm like, dude, are you serious? And that's why I feel like between him and the guy who creates Chainsaw Man, they are out for blood. Like, I, I hate the fact that we're taking really good characters. We're building them up. Not quickly or not too, too quickly. Um, and then next thing you know, we're killing them off and such. Now, there is one character who I think is also a part of the Zenin clan. And I'm praying he does not die. Because he, he good looking, even though I can always see him get animated. Um... But the, uh, all I know is the shit that Maki about to do. Oh, <laughs> it, it's just good. I, I'm just excited. I'm excited for a lot of things. But that's all I really know about these next this next arc in a nutshell without the other thing that I also know. But honestly, this was a really good season. Would I rewatch it again? That's the big question. Honestly, See, I have plans to rewatch like episodes with my friends tomorrow night, even though one of us does not want to watch this season because, of course, she has a huge crush on Nanami and she doesn't want to see it. And I'm over here like, I had to see it. We both had to see it. We all had to see it. It's okay, but we're still Delulu. In our minds, Nobara is okay and Nanami is in Malaysia. They're fine. They are okay. And they just happy, they thriving, they're living their lives. Nobara is just chilling. I feel like Nobara, like even the, the girl that Nobara was looking for, I think she's, she's gotta be dead. Because wasn't she in Tokyo as well? So she's dead. <laughs> I 
can't do this anymore. Oh my God. Depression. But I, I know the big thing we talked about um, the last couple of weeks was, was I going to do season three? I'm doing season three. I, I, I started this show. I've been with this show for the hottest minute. And I'm, I don't think I'm going to stop. I, I got to really continue with this because this show is too good. I love these characters too dang much, even though my heart is broken and I feel like you can't do it even worse, but it's gonna get worse. It's okay. I'm here for the journey until it abruptly ends. Even if we, even if the manga, the mangaka ends it in the most fucked up way, the most dumbest way that everybody is just... Mm, upset with him. And when it gets animated, I'll still be there. I'll be there till the fucking end. Just like with that and Chainsaw Man because I love those two series so freaking much. Even though I have read the series for it. <clears throat> because I'm trying to, you know, say anime only Belulu over here because I don't want to get spoiled on anything. But it just, it happens because we all get spoiled by something. But, yeah. I don't know what to do now since this is over. <laughs> I mean, I can rewatch everything, but it's like, mm, but yeah, know myself. And tomorrow night, yeah, me and my friends are gonna rewatch it, and I'm just gonna be over here trying not to cry. <laughs> okay, <laughs> but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards the entirety of season two of Jujutsu Kaisen. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like; it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all either whenever the hell season three is gonna come out. Like I said, maybe fall 2024 or sometime in 2025. <laughs> um, next week, of course, or really more of next weekend for the start of winter anime and then whatever the hell, hell is coming out in the next <clears throat> year. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!